There are 18 eyes, 14 noes. The bill is passed. Tonight, a race against the clock. In an unusual day at the Capitol politically, Republicans spending the day racing to pass new legislative maps drawn by Democratic Governor Tony Evers, while Democrats railed against it. Talk about some hypocrisy. There are tricks up your sleeves. The urgency Republicans successful 11th hour push to get in front of a looming state Supreme Court decision fearing new maps from the court's new liberal majority could be worse for Republicans than what the governor proposed. So we kind of have a gun to our head frankly is really how it's looking right now. The state Senate passing the maps on an 18 to 14 vote this afternoon which is one Democrat joining 17 Republicans in voting yes immediately sending it to the assembly for approval. Do you speaker have the votes to pass the governor's maps with no changes. Um, I, I think so. I think our members realize that we have been dealt a very difficult hand. And I have said from the very beginning that I think we can win under the maps that have been presented. The court, when ordering new maps, said justices would only choose new maps if the legislature and governor failed to reach an agreement. And that decision could come any day. The governor this past week on Upfront. If they pass them as is, absolutely no changes, would you sign that? Well, as you know, the first thing is they have to, they have to pass them. And I, I have great doubts that, that that could happen. But if, if my maps uh, are approved by the legislature, of course I'd sign them. Matt, any new word from the governor's office tonight? And how did the vote break down in the assembly happening in just the past two hours? No, nothing new from the governor's office tonight. The governor, though, pretty clear, as you just heard in our interview on Upfront, the ball now in his court in terms of whether he signs this. As for the assembly, identical to what we saw in the state Senate, just one Republican joining 62, one Democrat, that is, excuse me, joining 62 Republicans in the assembly, approving the governor's maps tonight, Kristen. All right, political director Matt Smith live at the Capitol. Thank you.